Hello everyone. During the lockdown time, pets is our good friend to pass the boring time. So today, let's draw a kitten. Meow. Hmm. <laughs> do not like this. Mm, like this one. Now let's do it. What I want to draw now is a giant among cats, man coon. When you start to draw the outline, first draw a center line for a cat's head. The center line is very important. The head and the body both has a center line. This time, I plan to draw a kitten with a tilted head. So, the center line of the kitten's head is an oblique. Next, draw the big round face of the kitten. It's so cute and makes you want to pinch the face. Start drawing the kitten's ears. It's very easy. Just draw a big sharp corner. And the painting method is the same on this side. After drawing the ears, you can draw the body the front legs and the, the bridging class. Because the center line of the body is used as a reference line, just mirror the drawing on the right side to the left. Do you think the center line is very helpful now? Next, add the big eyes to the kitten's face. Then the nose, draw an inward triangle. Then there are small mouths. Okay, the basic outline of the kitten is shown. Next, we can use a darker pencil to express the details in the outline. The more details you draw, the more realistic it will be. First, Start with the kitten's small nose and add the shape of the nostril to the inward triangle outline. Draw some shadows to express the relationship between light and dark. Then, draw the kitten's eyes. The kitten's eyes are like grass marbles. The highlights inside the eyes and the outline of the eyeballs must be drawn. Also, draw some shadows to express the relationship between light and dark. Here, using the center line of the head, the symmetrical drawing method, mirroring it, it is also the big round eyes highlights, eyeballs, and some shadows. Next, with a strip specific to the man coon's fur, which is also drawn just like the strips of tiger. Don't forget to fill in the shadow so that when the color is darker and lighter, you won't be confused.
Next come the ears. The ears are thick, so you can draw a few more ears contours. And don't forget to draw the cat fur inside the ears. Mirror image, draw the details on the other side, the same strips, the same lines. Okay, if you want to practice the coloring directly, you can also email me and I will send you the online picture of the kitten. You can print it online and just paint it. Let's start drawing the kitten's beard. The color at the base of the kitten's beard will be darker. We draw three dark lines, just like drawing a diamond's beard. The lines under the eyes of a man coin should be also be drawn, especially the eyes. One of the features of a man coin is that they have dark circles under the eyes. Then, the outline of the kitten's face is drawn. Next, drawing the kitten's body is much easier. The lines on the four legs and the paths are drawn out. Don't forget to draw slanted lines to fill in the shadow areas. The outline of the kitten is finished, and then you can use oil pastel to cut it. By the way, the background behind the kitten also simply draw the outline, and the painting immediately appears to have a sense of space. I like to draw the eyes first using black and blue to draw the eyes of the kitten. And then use the branding paper stamp to mix the two colors. Don't paint the highlights areas we reserved before. Then, draw the white part of the eyes, also through the mixture of the two colors, so that you can draw a sense of transparency. After the eyes are drawn, the next step is simple. First, draw the kitten's nose. The black nose is very cute. You can imagine the kitten smelling things everywhere with its small nose. The upper part of the nose is the darkest area that follows the kitten's fur, corresponding to the different shades of the color on the cat's fur. Black and brown are used directly for the darkest areas. Draw slowly, draw slowly, you need a little patience, and the white and yellow for the lightest areas. Remember, draw the slash shadow 
is the dark areas of the texture. And the area without the slash shadow is the light texture area. Just to feel the corresponding color. Is it very easy? When drawing cat's fur, you can draw the short straight lines at the same time to draw along the direction of extension of the cat's fur hair so that the texture of the fur hair can be drawn. Next, I will fast forward and play the painting process that I do. Does this look very enjoyable? Finally, don't forget to draw the background. The background color can be blurred so that it will be very real. Finally, use a white brush to draw the kitten's beard. Okay, the very cute mancoon is finished. Isn't it great? If you like my paintings, you are welcome to subscribe to my channel. Thank you all for taking the time to watch. See you next time. Bye-bye.